is it going guys slippery jim here welcome back to the dish on tower challenge in seven days to die and uh still doing some repairs i made a whole bunch of cement and concrete mix and some flagstone blocks here as well um earlier in the day and uh just repairing the pit here so i am thinking that i'm going to use this opportunity to replace um the second layer of blocks behind the pit with reinforced concrete and these ones back here where where the zombies have dug a big a big tunnel area i'm just gonna block block these out with um with flagstone blocks so flagstone blocks are not the best to be honest but they should be stronger than just the sand and dirt that's here right now if they get back this far next time um but Hopefully having a second layer of reinforced concrete in the um, uh, immediately behind the first layer is going to really slow them down for next time. That's the idea anyway. But um, it's just going to get more and more crazy as we go on. I think we're on, well, we're obviously on day 50, but uh, game stage, we're at like 2.30 something. Um and pretty much radiated zombies are spawning every day now so i really have to be on my toes that's for sure but it's pretty good that we can make pretty much a constant supply of uh concrete mix it uh, definitely helps with this sort of uh setup but anyway um after i finish the repairs down here what i'm gonna do is probably do a bit of mining overnight and see what else uh, I can find down underneath the building in terms of resources. There's still a few things, a few types of resources that I'd really like to find, like uh, coal, um, even stuff like lead um, I haven't found yet, which could come in handy. Let's just uh, upgrade these as well. These blocks around the edge don't take quite as much damage usually, but I might as well reinforce these as well since I've got this spare the spare uh, concrete mix and uh, then we're gonna go do a bit of mining and get some more resources overnight so I'm just gonna finish doing these repairs here it's getting a little bit late in the day nice all right uh, midnight guys so uh, I'm going to make my way as quietly as possibly possible over to the mine and uh, we'll do a bit of mining um wait is that a vulture oh crap the vultures are respawned out here and we got we've got uh we've got um darlene as well oh no that's not a vulture hang on that's uh oh no oh god I hate these spiders on me so much. Die! Oh, he dropped something for me. Ooh, this is pretty good. Get some shotgun rounds. We got uh, first aid kit. That's that's pretty good. Um, unfortunately, on the the downside, he sprained my leg. So I've got four minutes of sprained leg um, to put up with here. I thought I saw vultures, but uh, I think it was just. Oh, there's another zombie over there. Just wake. Just wake you up, fat boy. He would have woken up anyway. Oh, right in the side of the face. There you go. Give me back my arrow. Yeah, they sleep in the corners for some reason. It's a little bit weird. Thought I heard another zombie there for a second. I definitely don't want them um, following you down or trying to get into the mine area. Oh, there's a vulture up there. Let's see if we can take this vulture out. They have real, real problems with the ceilings. Which makes it easy for me. They seem to get confused by the, uh, by the, the corners of the beams and stuff. Just can't hit this guy. It's actually easier when they can fly straight at your head. 
Oh no. Uh let's just can I Wow, I just can't hit this vulture. Flapping around everywhere. Come on, I can do this. Or not. Here we go. That's what we... Oh, there's a screamer. Damn it. I hope she didn't call any zombies in. Almost certainly did, though. Once they uh, get a scream scream off, that's um, pretty much guaranteed that they're going to call in some zombies. Might as well fight them off real quick before we uh, go down in the mine. Um, oh, here we go. Oh, there's another screamer. Oh, <laughs> straight through the head. Let's take you out again. Oh, she didn't die in one hit. Usually they do. Maybe that's if it's a headshot. Okay, she's called in a radiated big mama. And uh, Mo. Hopefully these are the only two zombies to deal with here. Uh-oh. Short on stamina here. Plus I've got a sprained leg, so that doesn't help. Just drink some coffee real quick. There we go, you're done. Oh, beautiful. I love it when their heads explode. Saves me so much, so much time trying to take out those radiators. I think that's just about it, so uh, let's just carve up Vulture over here. Get some of those feathers. Then we should be good to uh, probably Good to go and uh, do some mining. Don't think there's any more zombies out there. Seems fairly quiet. Grab that arrow. Well, that was a little bit of excitement. Usually I manage to sneak down into the mine without alerting any zombies, but... Uh one of those nights, I guess, where we got two screamers and some radiated zombies. A couple of uh, spider zombies. I think it's pretty clear down here now, though. Should be okay. Had a little bit of repair work to do in the uh, stairwell as well. They love breaking those, um, those stairs. Okay, I don't know how much time I'm going to have left for mining down here, but we'll make the most of it. I usually like to do other things during the daylight hours. Um, let's put some of this stuff in here. Grab the pick. Um, and the shovel. There we go. Alright. Let's get down into the mine. I'm going to show you guys um, where it's at at the moment. How much I've uh, I've mined out currently. It's all pretty much in one corner. So I dug out a big square corridor around here. <laughs> Found nothing, nothing. The whole way around here, I was like, um, uh, there's nothing down here except sand. It's it's like, uh, it's terrible. And then I got to this corner over here where I was just about to give up. And there was actually quite a lot of different ore veins through here. So I've been following the gravel and the, the ore through this area. There's a fair bit of um, iron ore, um, stuff like oil shale. And uh, stone, stuff like that. It's not too bad. Got a little bit of nitrate as well. But I'm still looking for charcoal. Uh, not charcoal. Coal. And uh, lead. 
Um, that would really, if I could find particularly coal, that would really open up some opportunities for uh, making ammo and stuff like that. Um, not sure where I'm going to mine tonight. Let's see. Let's go through here. When I first started the mine, I was like super careful to put support pillars up everywhere. <laughs> but, uh... I sort of have been a bit slack at doing that through here. Hopefully it doesn't collapse on me. Okay, I think this is where I got up to here. This is where I left the torch, so let's just see what's um in this area here. It looks like we might have some iron ore. Let's see what else we've got here. I'm getting a little bit of oil shale here as well. That might be some more iron ore. So I'll use the pick on that shortly. See what else we've got down here. It's this, I think that's just uh, iron ore right there. Might as well mine this out. I do use quite a lot of scrap iron um, for a whole bunch of different things. Obviously reinforcing um, blocks. Making forged iron, making steel, all that stuff. Pretty much uh, got 1,001 uses. So I'm pretty happy I found a bunch of this down here, that's for sure. Um, what do we got here? That looks like a different kind of resource. What? 7,000? 7,000 durability. What the heck is this? Interesting. Definitely not coal. It's gonna take a while. It's gonna take a while to mine this out. Oh, we got a chunk of it. What is that? Silver nugget. When mining, you'll occasionally find rare metals or minerals. $41. Yeah. Unfortunately, I think this is just for trading with. Can't really do much with it. Apart from trade it with um, the traders, who uh, obviously I can't get to because I'm stuck inside Dishong Tower. Oh, well, I guess I'll get it for, uh, I don't know, collection purposes. Okay, pretty much done with mining for the time being. We got uh, 14 silver nuggets out of that little chunk, which was pretty nice. Um, bit of iron ore, not a lot of... Uh, not a lot of other resources, but um, what I'm going to be doing now is just getting organized and we'll head up and clear the building of zombies, I think. Haven't done that for a little bit, so I'll we'll spend so much time repairing and stuff. And uh, yeah, hopefully we can uh, keep getting some more XP and stuff like that. See what happens. Let's go. If I can get uh, up this ladder here. There we go. Alright, looks like there's a spot here that needs repairing as well. Just put some temporary blocks here for now. I will reinforce those later probably. Let's check, uh, check out level 4. Oh, I think I see some sleeping zombies back there. Let's do this. Um, Alright. Should probably uh, reinforce that just in case there's ferals and radiated zombies and stuff like that. <laughs> yeah, can never be too careful these days. Let's see what we've got over here. He's just a normie. Oh, I think he's. Oh, God. Okay. He's just 
regular zombies, so that's okay. There's a bunch of them on this floor, though, I can tell already, so... Just gonna clear each section as we go. There's another guy right here. Let's wake him up with an arrow. Actually, you know what? Let's... <laughs> Let's do the old SMG to the head. Ooh. Oh god, okay. It's always two at once. Oh no. Man, I lost so much health. Let's block them off here real quick. I'm so glad that this uh, doorway thing works because <laughs> it saved my uh, saved my life so many times. Three barrels at once. Oh no, I've got uh, you feel something coming on status right now. Hopefully that's not going to lead to an infection. Okay, a lot of businessmen, businessmen zombies on this floor. So we get up to about here. Just uh, make sure there's none coming out of the toilets at me. Let's keep looking through the offices here. Okay, there's one, definitely one there. He might be a feral, actually. Oh, he is a feral for sure. Oh, God. What's up? Let's back up. Yeah, they're both ferals. And it's getting crazy now. Oh, I'm bleeding. This is bad. This is real bad. So, but tight. Come on. <laughs> Fortunately, they get a little bit confused with their pathfinding if you come through the partitions here sometimes. What the heck? What the heck? He's, uh, okay. Uh, he's twitching. I think he's dead. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Let's go back through and check the rest of this office area here. Go over in the corner there. Wow, they're all ferals back here. Definitely helps if you get that knockdown first off. Can I get that arrow? That's some good penetration right there. That went straight through the uh, partition. Okay, have we got more zombies back here? Let's have a look over here. Oh, here we go. More ferals. This is crazy. Oh no, 41 health. Oh, I'm so glad I got those knockdowns. Sounds like there's another zombie over here somewhere. Or is it? Oh. Broke its way through. Interesting. I think that's cleared back down in that corner. And they're pretty much on every... Uh, every corner of this floor. Getting to the point where the normal zombies are are rarer than the uh, the ferals. Oh, hello. Where'd you come from? Let's just bandage up real quick. Gotta watch my back. Super low on health right now. Okay. Alright, I'm, I'm just going to assume there's more zombies in this corner as well. <laughs> They've been everywhere else on this floor. Yep. 
This uh this is weird. This shouldn't be this shouldn't be happening. Theoretically, everywhere below the land claim block should be free of zombies. Which is quite a quite a large area that it covers as well. Normally it it works out to about half the floor being free of zombies, but it looks like the entire floor is infested right now. It's a bit alarming, to be honest. It has been a day or two since I played on this save, so I'm just hoping my land claim block's not malfunctioning again. I haven't been up to the rooftop for a while now, so I guess we'll find out when we get up there. Uh, yeah, the whole floor is pretty much clear of zombies now anyway, which is good. Just block that off. Yeah, they've really been uh, smashing this, this stairwell. See if there's any construction worker zombies on this level. Gonna get ready to block the doorway off. Oh, it doesn't look like there's any back here. Huh, this floor looks like it's clear. Interesting. Well, let's, uh, let's go up. Keep going up. What about Mole's gym? While I'm here, I'm probably going to refill my jars. Oh, we do have zombies. There's a footballer in there as well. Here we go. <laughs> oh god. Bunch of footballers in there. This could be a problem right now. <laughs> Let's just block off that doorway. Hopefully they don't get smart and go around and through the other one. Gotta love that burning effect, it's so good. Alright. <laughs> so glad I blocked off this doorway. Oh, we got a lit drop. Oh, two pistols. Two pistols and a little bit of ammo. That's that's not too bad. I can scrap those pistols and they'll give me pretty much all the ammo in them. Let's get that arrow back there. Yeah, this looks like we've got zombies through this whole floor here. I didn't see any inside the... Uh, the die bitch room though. Uh oh. Level 91? That's crazy. Okay, these are just normies. Dealt with. What else have we got back here? Let's have a look. Uh, let's see. I probably want to come down actually and buy some cam food out of one of these. Uh, oh, there's a fat guy through there. Out of one of the vending machines. Um, prob I'll probably get all my jukes together and um, just buy all the cheapest cans so that I can use the, uh, you know, eat them all and then use the cans. Oh, God. Then use the cans for um, making molotovs with. That <laughs> sounded like a solid connection. Where's that other zombie at? Let's be through the other wall there. Yeah, 
Okay, nothing else here. Oh no! Oh god! Oh god! Radiated! Cowboy! <laughs> Just uh, as I was checking my inventory as well. Let's just grab this. And this. That gives me a good chunk of pistol ammo. For the SMG. Let's make sure we've got max bandages. Um, overweight right now, which is not ideal, so, like, two oil showers not really going to help me out much. Okay, we got some zombies back here. Let's go for the military dude first. Oh, we just one-shot Darlene. That was pretty sweet. That guy's got a fair bit more health, though. Oh. That looked like I missed him for a second there. Nice. <laughs> the bigger they are, the harder they fall. Yeah, there's a lot of... Wow, we've got nurses back here as well. They look like they're guarding the entrance. Like they're bouncers or something. So good. That sneak damage is pretty good on these weaker zombies. Okay, there's radiated right there. Radiated receptionist? Or reception... Receptionist? Yeah. Rep <laughs> I was like... What's the male version of receptionist? It's, yeah, it's still a receptionist. Okay, yeah, you're dead. Okay, is that all of them on this floor? Let's just check back. I think that's everyone. Unless there's some dudes out on the, um, out on the gantry. Hanging off the side of the building. So, this is probably a good opportunity to get my um, jars filled. That beautiful chlorinated water. Let's see if there's anyone out here. There probably will be. Is that a vulture back there? Oops. Oh no. That was that was not good. That was not. Oh sweet. I thought it was gonna fall off the side there. Grab those feathers. Yeah, we're um We're managing to clear the building slowly but surely today. It's been a little bit dangerous, but uh Nearly got all my health back now, which is good. Thinking we might just go up to the rooftop and, and check that, because I'm a little bit worried right now in terms of uh, whether we're going to have zombies spawned up there again. I can hear sleeping zombies here. Usually you see them if they're at um, Tickles Medical, but they might be here on level 12. Uh, we'll come back. I just want to check the, the rooftop real quick. Lock that off. Oh no, we've definitely got zombies up here. That's not good. It's probably going to be a repeat of a few days ago when we had uh, 
crazy numbers of uh, radiated, radiated zombies. Where is that zombie at? Hey! Oh god! What the hell, man? Where that? I guess he came from. Uh... Oh boy! Oh boy! He's waking up Big Mama as well. Just drop it down the side there. No need to waste arrows. Sounds like they're breaking through. Oh no, that was a different. Interesting. I guess we're going to have to kill these zombies after all. You know what? Let's just deal with the rooftop zombies first. Hopefully we don't wake up any of those other guys. Sounds like they're right below me or something though. That sounds super close. Where is that? Was is it this guy? Uh oh. Let's just put this back and uh, reinforce that. We got a lot of zombies on this level. Take care of her first. Just debuff her. Oh no, that's a white. It's a white coming. You can tell by the sound of their uh, gross toenails or whatever it is. Pitter patting, pitter pattering on the floor. Let's head back to the uh, top here. Oh boy. I'm so low on stamina right now. Okay, off the side you go, <laughs> see ya! I wish it killed them when they fell, but unfortunately it doesn't. I don't know how high it would have to be to actually kill them, but um, it's not high enough, unfortunately. Okay, um, let's replace that. Got another fat Hawaiian dude. Sweet, he's dealt with. Okay, here we go. Radiated Marlene. Reload this. He's just a feral. But, uh... Uh-oh. I'm out of uh, scrap iron. Oh no, I'm stunned. Oh god! Completely out of stamina. Alright. There you go. Here comes fat boy. He's gonna drop. Oh no! Where'd that vulture come from? <laughs> it's like... Came out of nowhere. He just collapsed. I guess, I guess coming up the stairs was too much for him. I think these, these guys are coming from level 13. Nice. And the businessmen that are coming up the stairs are from level 12, I think.
Just check if there's any more zombies back here. Okay, we got another vulture. <laughs> A lot of vultures today, it's really weird. I don't really encounter them that often. Except uh, when they spawn out on the gantry. No one in the bathroom. Okay, we got zombies back here. I think they're both dead. Uh, yeah, the whole floor is pretty much... I think what it is, is um, it's like reset the whole building with zombies. Almost. Because um, I did have a day or two um, off playing this game. And that was a big mistake, apparently. Because I'm pretty sure my uh, land claim block is probably uh, decayed. Just why we've got all this. Oh my goodness, this is a bad situation right now. Uh, uh oh. Oh god. Oh no. Oh god. I don't have much room to move here. Let's try and circle back this way. Uh, I need to block them off somewhere. Uh, please don't go around. Those feral whites are the worst, to tell ya. Oh, we got another vulture? Um, let's see if we can... Oh, no, there's red... Wow! <gasps> oh, this is, uh... This is crazy right now. Imagine if I didn't have this as my backup right here. Look at them all. Wow. <laughs> oh man, that is crazy. I haven't even started clearing the rooftop yet. I think there's like at least half a dozen vulture spawns usually on these air conditioning units. Let's see what we've got back here. Yeah, here they come right now. <laughs> Oh no! There's, there's a lot of vultures. Hopefully I can get them all to come at once. Uh, yeah, look at that. It's um, definitely... The land claim block is definitely um, decayed. I need to be much more careful to try and log on every day. Otherwise that seems to happen. I wish they made it so if you're, if you're a solo player on your in your own game, it the um, land claim block doesn't decay because it's kind of stupid. It's a mechanic designed for a multiplayer server. Oh boy. Go away, vulture. Oh, I missed. Oh no. I've got to be careful here. I've come this far. <laughs> I did not want to screw it up now. Let's drop these two. Uh, Chunky dudes off the side here. Just gotta be careful not to fall off the side of the building again. Let's take you out. A lot of dead vultures all over the place. Might as well just harvest them real quick. Waste not, want not. There's another one here. Uh oh. What? Come at me, bro. <laughs> and we'll drop him off the side. See ya. Yeah, I need to craft another one of these. 
At least I kind of know what to do now after the last time this happened. Um, I need to replace... I need to basically remove the old one. The old land claim block. And uh, replace it with a new one. It seemed to fix it last time. Man, a little bit of lag going on. <laughs> There's something so satisfying. Oh! Radiated feral white. There is so many zombies right now. The trouble is I might just be respawning them as soon as they fall like to the bottom. Um, yeah, I need to get rid of this old one here. Until I actually kill them, I think they're just going to keep respawning in the same spots. This, like, that's the guy. Oh, he came back up the stairs, though. So he didn't respawn. He definitely actually made the, uh, made the jog up the stairs from, from the ground floor. So some of them don't despawn when I drop them off the side. Uh, I should probably just focus on... Let's just quickly try and get rid of this old one here. Alright. Just put that one back in there. So theoretically that should fix the problem. That's how that's how I fixed it last time. We just have to kill the remaining zombies off. <laughs> so many vultures spawn up top. At least there's no dogs, I guess. Let's look on the bright side. Could be worse. Could be a pack of radiated dogs up here. Um, I really need to wear my... Oh, boy. And we got a feral white as well. It could take a while to to uh to clear the rooftop. It, it definitely took a took a long time last time this happened to uh get rid of all the zombies. Oh, is that a cop back there somewhere? I remember the first time this happened, there was actually a whole bunch of cops that kept spawning. This time around, it's like, uh, it's mostly the big mamas and the feral whites. Where is that guy? I can hear him somewhere. Oh, here he comes. Let's try and, try and take this guy out. He's just going to keep coming up the stairs. Just die! Will you just die? <laughs> Man, these things have so much health. There we go. Oh, hello. <laughs> she came out of nowhere. See ya. 
getting hot up here on the rooftop. Um, so are they still going to keep respawning or is there more back here that I haven't woken up yet? Um, I really want to wear this. Uh-oh. Oh, yeah. Okay, we got another feral wire back there. At least he's not radiated. Might just uh, drop him off the side again. Okay. <laughs> Um, is this working? Looks like it's, it should be working. Uh-oh. Oh, what the hell, man? You spawn inside the blocks? It's like the, um, the frames. The frames don't stop them spawning. You have to actually have a solid block, I think. Wish I, I wish I had, uh, I wish I had unlimited ammo. It would make this much easier. Oh, I've got so little stamina and I'm, uh, encumbered right now as well. Okay, well, uh, let's have a look here. I'm pretty sure that land claim block was active. So. Let's just take care of this radiated big mama. Is that the last zombie? This is the question. Hopefully. Hopefully we're clearing zombies now. Just get organized here. Thought I heard a zombie there. There's a zombie somewhere. Somewhere around the place. Uh, just chuck some of this stuff in here. Um, where am I putting my... Man, I've got so many feathers. Wow, that was a crazy day. I did not expect it to turn out like this. I mean, I expected to be killing some zombies, but... It's pretty crazy. Lots of XP, though. I mean, obviously, I didn't kill all the zombies that we that we spawned up here, but most of them we just dropped off the side, but um, still the ones we did kill. I'm going to have to repair this area here. That was very weird how he spawned. Oh, no, that's a feral. That's a feral white. Oh, why? Was he on the other side? Like... Was he behind the fence? And then we've got another radiated... Please don't tell me they're still spawning. Um... I have no idea what to do if... If, if they're gonna keep respawning, like, after I've replaced the land claim block... I've got no idea how to fix it. Unless it's something to do with the bedroll here. I did pick this up and put it back down last time. 
Let's just try that, but I don't see how that would affect anything. I should do something more permanent with this area here. Like, these frames are a little bit on the crude side. Oops. What the? <laughs> this stupid... Stupid tree uh, got in the way there, I think. Uh, I'm going to put it right there. There we go. It's just like a little ramp to get me up and over. Are there any zombies down there? Oh, boy. Yeah, they're, they're still spawning back here. In the same spots. This has got to be a glitch. Or, uh, oh, no. 26 health. I've got to recover my health. Man, it would suck if he managed to jump across the gap. It would be pretty much game over if he did. Yeah, they're still spawning here though. This is a real this is a real nightmare right now. Uh This is definitely active, but maybe I should uh I don't know. Maybe I should try moving it to a different location altogether. Really not quite sure what to do here. Just put the silver in here, I guess. With all the other useless cash that I've accumulated from looting. Um, let's grab some of those. Some arrows. I wonder if they're going to respawn. This is the question. I just turned around and they basically respawned that last time. I need to get my health back up. Let's um, cook this up. Put some more fuel in there. Oh, yeah, he just respawned. He just respawned out of nowhere. I wonder if Big Mumba's going to respawn as well in a second. This is crazy. You know what? Uh, maybe I could try... Maybe I could try closing the game and uh, restarting and see if that resets, uh, resets the spawns. Fixes it. Let's try that out. Hopefully this fixes some um, whatever glitch is going on here because this is pretty insane. We get back in the game here. Here we go. All right, my maximum health is low. Yes, I know. <laughs> Thank you very much, game. I'm well aware um, that I need to replenish my health right now. I wonder how my armor's going with all this uh, fighting. Uh, it's not too bad. It, it does need repairing pretty soon, though. Um, the big question, though, is... Uh, oh, no, Big Mama's back! Big Mama's back again. Even reloading the game doesn't look like it's fixed that problem. Um, well. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know. I guess we'll wait and see what happens, but... Um, maybe I'll craft another one of these. 
That's all I can think of is maybe... Because I did put it back in the same spot, you know what? I might try, uh... Might try moving it to a different location, like right here. We'll try putting it in this spot here. Um... See if this fixes things. Can't see any more zombies. That looks like it's going to cover a good chunk of the building. I think that's going to protect right up to the edge here. These trees look like they're just about ready to chop down. Yeah, both, both sides here. So the edge is... It is pretty much safe. Theoretically. Turn that off. Um, and we'll destroy the old one. Let's get rid of this. Love that ominous music when you destroy it. It's like, dun, dun, dun. Uh, but, uh, yeah. Hopefully this one is gonna stop the respawning. Um, I guess time will tell if this is gonna work or not, but... It's been a little bit weird. Make sure this is repaired to max. I need some more materials here. Uh, scrap iron is what I'm missing right now. Okay, that should do it. Anyway, um, I guess uh, we just got to wait it out and see, see if we're all, all clear of zombies this time, but so far so good. So I'm just going to get uh, organized here. And, um, yeah, I think uh, that's probably a good spot to end the episode for today, guys. Um, time will tell as to whether the zombies are going to respawn again up here on the rooftop. But, I mean, it's been like, feels like about five minutes and no respawn. So, so far so good. And hopefully it stays like this. I like having my safe zone up here. But it's definitely been good having this, um... This drop trap right here, that, that's a real lifesaver. Um, it's worked out pretty good. So, so glad I uh, decided to build this thing. But uh, yeah, we'll leave it there for today, guys. Hope you're enjoying this series of the Dishong Tower Challenge. Day 51, another day survived. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Slip your gym out.